So, continuing on the custom card review stream, we're going to be talking about a LR hit by Jeff. I hope I said your name correctly. But before I go ahead and read the message inside the email as well as get to the card, please go ahead and send me custom cards over to bhdevcustomcards at gmail.com so I can go ahead and read your custom card in the future, as well as, uh, you know, uh, me getting all these older cards out the way. If you send me multiple custom cards, I write it down, blah, blah, blah. You guys know the gist. Now, with that being said, Jeff who says, uh, big hug from a big fan. Hey, big hug from a big fan, Jeff. Hey, I appreciate you. Keep up the good work, homie. Ah, uh, it's, it's all love, man. It's all love. Uh, by Jeffu uh, slash Drips of Monsters, I guess. Name looks familiar. Are you from my Discord server? Oh, while you're at it, join the 24 7 Discord server. Links down below in the description below. Okay, so Jeffu says in the, uh, the message below it This was made some days ago due to my annoyance with kale's part two not having well just says having nothing so kale's part two having nothing to do with top i think kale's part two lr was super boo a super boo right i think it was lr super boo uh so i just made a hit simply giga stupid uh, in parentheses uh and nowadays hard content these days are approaching a lot from doing two mil on supers man we're getting we're getting pretty high with those bosses doing these ridiculous supers like a goku and frieza all right so uh jeff who thank you for sending me a card hope i said your name correctly again i made a document out of his card so i don't have to stay on the email the entire time i just want you know make it look you know just look nice on the video i mean not that it's not nice inside the email i don't mind emails uh being sent to me with just custom cards and only text but i feel like it's uh better for me if someone sends me like it in text i just go ahead and slap it on a little google document and just call it a day as well as take their picture with it and just throw it on there and it seems like there's a twitter handle right there too so shout out to the person that made this art so with that being said unbeatable assassin of the sixth universe hit his rarity is a carnival lr as well as his typing being extreme tech his leader skill is Universal Survival Saga, three key and 200% across the board, of course, because he is a Carnival LR. And I will quickly just go ahead and say that Universal Survival Saga is carried by its LRs. I mean, you have LR Tech Jiren, it's easy A, of course. You have LR UI, you have uh, LR Jiren, you have uh, both the six year easy A's, you have Evo Ken, you have STR UI, you have Golden Freezing 17. It's like, you also have Team Universe 7. It's like, this team is absolutely carried by its LRs. For, for damn sure it's definitely the case um now you do have topo you do have dispo you do have the uh sub easy a's for um for reps universe 7 of course i mean this guy this guy right here the, the shape up boo nasty option okay so the 12 key that being the sudden elimination you get 30 percent attack and defense for three turns while doing colossal damage of course you forgot to add that but i just go ahead and say that anyways just because and the 18 key, that being the time cage, greatly stack attack and defense, as well as a 70% chance of stun while massively lowering attack and defense on the enemy, of course, while doing mega colossal damage. So, of course, uh, for both the 12 and 18 key super attack effects, they are strong, as well as him having a debuff, massively lowering attack, of course, that's that's great. I mean, being able to massively lower the, the enemy's attack, while meanwhile having a 70% chance to stun, of course, is a two turn stun, considering the fact that it's inside his 18 key super attack, or it could be from his 18 key super attack to his 12 key, either or, the stun chance is a 70% chance, so it's pretty damn high. So you have uh, two separate debuffs inside his 18 key, as well as stacking, which is strong, and his 12 key, a multi-turn attack and defensive buff, it doesn't get any standard and good from here. So, his passive, Target Detected, make sure it looks good on here, it does, okay. So, passive Target Detected, 200% attack and defense at the start of turn, 6 key, just, just 6 key, just at the start of turn, 2, I guess. He also has a 70% chance to dodge in the first or second slot, strong, of course. Uh, guaranteed dodges and launches an additional super in slot three so he is a strong slot three option so he works very well in all slots that's very good he also launches two additional attacks that both have a 70 percent chance to become super attacks when key is 18 or more so you just get an 18 key super attack and he has additional super attack chance which is at a very very high chance that being at a 70 percent chance he also gets an additional super attack as well as a 50 percent chance to crit when key is 20 or that is very good he also guards all attacks when all allies are universal spouse saga or when enemy cancels dodge 
I like that. Wow, so if the enemy does cancel dodge, this guy guards. Interesting. And he builds up 20% attack up to 100% with each attack dodged, which he'll very easily get. And he also builds up 20% defense up to 100% for every attack performed, which should be very easy considering the fact that's only 5 attacks. And he also gets additional 40% defense for all allies when there is an ally with type disadvantage against the enemy. No, that's 40% defense for all allies. So that's, that's basically for him too. Because it would have said excluded for himself. So he gives... Okay, so if... With an ally type disadvantage against the enemy. Interesting. So if you have an ally on a turn who's type disadvantage against the enemy, he gives 40% defense to all allies including himself. That's pretty... This, I've never seen this before. I really like that. And... Plus 50% attack to self when under type advantage against enemy. So he gets stronger when he's facing an enemy he's type advantage against. And he supports when you have an ally who is type disadvantage against enemy. I really think that's... This is a seriously interesting design. Jeffu, you're cooking. This is this is what I look for right here. This, this is interesting design. Absolutely. And 45% damage reduction when performing the sixth attack in battle. So he's rewarded for getting all his defense per attack performed up to 100%, which is that that's five attacks. So once he finishes building up his defense and he does that sixth attack, he's rewarded with damage reduction. This is very nice, very, very nice. So this guy has practically every defensive tool in his passive, that being dodge inside the first or second slot of course that being a 70 percent chance to dodge inside the first or second slot as well as guaranteed dodge when he's inside the third slot he has guard when all allies attack in the same turn are universal so outside character or when you're facing an enemy who cancels dodge and he has damage reduction from the sixth attack in battle that being 45 percent so if you really look at it in slot one this guy has a 70 percent chance to dodge um, also, and provide it if you got all six attacks, he has a 70% chance to dodge, 45% damage reduction, and guaranteed guard because you're going to be running a full universal swap saga team with this guy. You're definitely running double with this guy. So, guard with 45% damage reduction and a 70% chance to dodge. Meanwhile, this guy has how many additional supers he can do? So, he gets additional super attack chances right over here. He launches two additional attacks, both have a 70% chance to come with super attack when he is 18 or more. That's strong obviously and he just does a a guarantee super as well as has crit chance built into him when he's at 24 key i mean we're already we're already looking pretty good this guy's looking very strong i do like this i like this a lot this i like this a lot the fact that he gives defense when there's an ally who's type disadvantage against an enemy this is a very very interesting restriction to give to a unit like this this is interesting i like this as well as him giving himself attack for him being type advantage over the enemy this i look for stuff like this this is the most interesting part of the card easily because i've never seen it before it's like like i'm used to seeing like units that just do a whole lot of stacking uh as well as you know have like dodge i mean this for this card for example dodge damage reduction guard he has all of it pretty much provided he builds up all his damage reduction. well not build up his damage structure, but build up his, um, he does all of his attacks, and, and of course, he's rewarded for doing all his attacks, so he gets the damage structure at the sixth attack, I like the design, outright, he just has a strong design, I mean, let's just go ahead and keep it a thousand, as well as him having a guaranteed, just dodge is guaranteed in sudden third slot, I, I like this card design a lot, yes, yeah, I'm just gonna leave it at that, so, his active skill, of course, domain, that being the time skip, I mean, an LR hit, we need an LR hit, he deserves an LR. Absolutely. Absolutely. Dokkan, don't disrespect Hit by giving him a prime battle LR. Don't you, don't you dare. Don't do it, Dokkan. Don't do it. Okay. So the conditions, starting from the sixth turn in battle or when HP is 60% or lower, or when there's a super class form of God's enemy. So <clears throat> Blue Cow can go. Just, just put that out there. Like Blue Goku. Just makes sense i like the condition <laughs> um so six turn from start of battle okay so effects enemy cannot attack for five turns okay the condition is oh the, the condition's fine because this is 
stupid strong. So you get multiple turns of Ghost Ushers. <laughs> Allies can only attack when key is max. Self excluded. Wow. Okay, so uh so his hit domain his passive. It's called time to make some donuts. I forgot to make it red. Let me just go ahead and make that red. Okay, so time to make some donuts. 600% attack and 12 key at the start of turn. He changes int, str, and agl orbs to tech. So he's a triple orb changer to one specific key sphere. All right. He does a guaranteed crit when key is 24, which you're going to very easily get because he changes three different types of key spheres to his specific key sphere that he needs. He also launches three additional super. <laughs> <laughs> and plus one key to allies for every 10% HP less when activating the domain. So he's giving key for for every H for every 10% HP. He well every 10% HP you don't have when you activate the domain. Plus a hundred percent attack for all allies when all allies are universal survival saga, which you're gonna have because he is a 200 percent let's go to universal survival saga. Um he does three additional supers, guarantee crits, triple orb changes, 600% attack, 12 key at the start of turn with it, and he's giving 100% attack support while giving key support. Um, okay. And his links are Cold Judgment, uh, Termin of Power, Experienced Fighters, Shocking Speed, Over in the Flash, Fierce Battle, and Legendary Power. And these are his categories as shown. And these are stats for my stat junkies. You guys want to go ahead and go bananas. Um, uh, I okay uh hit hits looking looking pretty interesting <laughs> so jeff Hoot, thank you for sending in your card i think that's going to be about it i mean we need lr hit i'm just gonna go ahead and say that uh but with that being said go ahead and send me custom cards to g to bhdev custom cards at gmail.com so i can go ahead and read your card in the future as i get all these older cards out the way you guys already know the uh just i think this card was sent to be around like september around like september 20th i don't remember so it was in september though but yeah i appreciate you guys watching you guys do that join, join the 24 7 discord server the link is down below in the description below so you guys can join uh hope you guys got something good for your 77 ticket months i think it was a little 77 ticket thing i'm gonna do mine today but peace